Hello, 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 and welcome back again, one and all. I am Pete, AK Crimson, and I hope you're all doing well. We're chilling out this chilly afternoon. Chill for chilling. Um, a bit more out of world here. We were. We just took out the boss of the boss first factory, right? Um, who may or may not have been eating people. Uh, yeah. I need more medical. <sighs> I need more many things. Mainly skills. Damn it. <laughs> I wonder if one of the stats adjusts how many skill points you get. If so, I wish I'd raised it higher. May just be 10, though. Catherine. Right. Let her know. Uh, anything else around here? Go to his apartment, which is back at town. So, yeah, let's go do that. Uh, yeah. I think. Yeah. And I just got a load more carry capacity, so that's pretty good. Slices, dices, cauterizes. Alright. Looks fine enough. There's no lightsaber. I see the internet going mad about Baby Yoda. Um, not seen Mandalorian yet myself. Looks kind of... eh. We'll see. Limited hope for... the franchise, really, but... Classics are still classics, right? And I can at least try and enjoy the new ones for what they are. Not that the classics were flawless in any way. Uh wanna make a run with me to Stella Bay? Nah mate, you're all right. There's my volume. I do love these guitar twangs. Also reminds me of Firefly. Catherine Malin could sour milk just by glaring at it. You know how there's folk are all crusty outside, but warm and squishy inside. I'm pretty sure she's crust all the way through. She's she's right here, but okay. Please say the Yoda corpse you're wearing is Clive's. Uh, he's deceased. Huh. Not much boast to that declaration. Am I to take that to mean you didn't kill him? Does it matter? He's dead. I suppose it rightly don't, no. But now I'm gonna fucking wonder for months. Thanks for that. Still, this ought to compensate for your troubles. And take an aromatic. You stink like sissy pig. Fuck you too. Uh, took care of your little drug running problem? I guess, did I? Funny you don't look like Nelson Mason. Funnier still, I wasn't aware of an existing problem. Oh? Shit, I can't remember what this is about. Uh, <laughs> he tried to cut costs. I'll take my fee for services rendered all the same, deduct it from his wages. Oh, that, yeah, yeah. That thunderhead. Can't hardly fathom how that panned out. Uh, I didn't mean to grass him in. Let me guess. It involved blood and guts and fur in places that don't merit mention. Well, you got my begrudging gratitude for cleaning the mess. Or did I just get rep for it and he's fine? Give me a room. I take it you don't have a reservation. No matter. I keep a suite of VIP rooms for visitors of your... Let's call it a certain means. Yeah, boy. The VIP rooms charge by the night. 
But for you, I'll make it a one-time fee. Got a feeling you'll make me a fine investment. You betcha. Ooh, bribe. For 288, consider it sold. I'd probably have that, right? Easy. Marvelous. Do take care of the place. Maid service won't clean after a murder. We're homeowners, boys. Let's go. Where's our home? Uh. Uh. But for real, though, how am I going to find our home? Uh. <laughs> um. Does it say? Of course it doesn't. It's gonna unlock a house. Don't need to do that yet. I need to find my house. Housey, housey. Uh So that puddle I stepped in. Okay. Workbench bonus. Kind of pointless to start ransacking my own place. Especially when I don't need the shit. So that can just stay there as decoration, I guess. Whatever that is. We've got a bed, we've got a bench. Just syringes laying around the sink. Lovely. Uh. Yeah. Wait. What? Dehydrated water tablets. Water without the hydrogen or oxygen. Sugary drink. What? Just add air. Now available in carbonated. Th what? What? I mean, I get the joke, obviously. But... Alright. Trying to think how that would function as an actual sellable object. It's like selling an air guitar. I guess people do it. What do I need... Or want to keep out of this. I need to sell my junk. Who wants my junk? <laughs> the title of my sex tape, I guess. Don't need the rake. Anyway, uh, don't really need to upgrade anything either. Back over there. That is over on Scylla. We could go return that, but let's clear up here first, at least of side quests. And that's also on Scylla. So, let's go do the secret people, I guess. Which is still going to be back in Stella Bay. Bow now. Alrighty. Like, they're not particularly pretty environments, per se. 
But they are nice to look at. Immersive. Grimy. Someone's been killed. Oh. This is my quest, I guess. I think I'm gonna be sick. Uh, you're right. No! I just stepped in a dead man's blood. And I think one of the flies landed on my mouth. Unlucky. If you're going into the apartments, do not go into the lower one on the right. That's where the body is. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to go contemplate a hot shower. Only contemplate? Carbony walks off. Alright. Uh... Get rid of that junk. Uh, that shit can stay there. Oh my. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Just spooked me, was all. Yes, search for clues. We go hunting for clues? That's what I'm going to do. Search for clues. There's a clue, it was some bits. Here's another clue. And another. Clues everywhere. Mm. This is definitely a clue. Uh, that's got to be a clue. Mm. Alright. We don't need that clue. It's probably inconsequential. What do we got? Uh, this betting slip lists some increasingly bold wages for a team called Mostly Colonists. Alright, it's from left field, Tossball Betting. There's a clue, I guess. And several ragged outfits, all of the same cut and colour, were stuffed into this suitcase. Suitcase? Really? S not, a, not a satchel. Alright. Investigate betting. I'm glad that is an objective. Because otherwise I would never have found it. Wait, is it upstairs? Whatever you do, don't mention crossball to Isaac. You'll never hear the end of it. You know, I haven't seen it. If you got him stuck in an hour long rant about mostly colonists, you'd be thankful. No. Ha. Huh. Apartment. Three meters. Maybe if I... No? Why no? Well, I mean... Don't sneak up on a person like that, huh? I stood up. Uh, I'm looking for Braxton. Have you seen him? Braxton? I've never even heard of a Braxton. Got nothing for you. Sorry. Uh-huh. Uh, relax. No one's in trouble. I'm just looking to have a friendly chat with him. Oh. In that case, he told me he was delivering to this house in the ruins south of town family had fallen sick and he had some meds on hand so maybe look for him there that's all I needed poor fella hope he's okay we should hurry captain hey hurrying <laughs> what was your family like Felix did you ever know I never knew him I was a stowaway that's what they call orphans who grow up in the back bays. Oh, gosh. I'm sorry. I must have been lonesome. Come on, Parvati, who are you talking to? Imagine me pining after my family. Yeah, I suppose that was a touch lonesome. But hey, look at me now. I made it. I got a ship and everything. All right. Where are we looking?
So we want to go to the south exit. That one? Guess so. to visit Stellar Bay. Taking the sights, the sounds, the... Wait, what's that smell? Right. Yes. All right. Let's dance. Nice one. Congrats, Mark. Get wrecked. Best there ever was. Bodied. <laughs> Need more long guns too. What is my long guns at? 57. Crits ignore 100% of armor. <sighs> That's pretty good. Searching for clues. More clues. Me. Hmm. Fine. He's dead. What are you doing to that poor sprat? Hey. Boosh. Silent. But deadly. <laughs> I've been waiting for this. You scared it away. Got it. Are we good? Not quite. Here we go. Get fucked. Get him. Sorry. Are you? Shouldn't be. Are these real ruins? Huh. It's just like in the cereals. I wonder who used to live here. Do you suppose anyone remembers anymore? What's that icon? Is my gun R repairable? It's hundred percent condition. Well, I mean, I may as well. What? Alright. Sure. Hey, what's that top of- oh, that's to move them. That's right. Alright, nothing else in there. Uh, next house, sure. Try 
transition. Odd. How big's this house? What do they call these? Hmm. A visitor? What an unexpected surprise! Please come in. Come in. Uh. We're armed the teeth. What's he gonna do? Kill us with generosity? That's the spirit. Now come in. Make yourselves comfortable. Uh. Don't mind if I do. Excellent. You've arrived at just, just the right time. Just go with it. My wife is putting the finishing touches on dinner. Dinner? Please, make yourself at home until it's ready. I think I just lost my appetite. Uh. Hello? Oh, hello there. You come for, for, uh, dinner? What's the deal? Actually, I'm looking for a man named Braxton. Sorry, I'm not real good with... Uh, More cannibals? Names. Have they eaten him? Is something wrong? It just gets hard to remember things. I recall moments, feelings, but the details slip. Uh-huh. I felt like that after my dad passed. Walked around in a haze for weeks. I'm sorry you're feeling that way, too. Other times, it's like there's fog. I... Sorry, have we talked about this before? Oh. Maybe I can help you. That's nice of you. I usually feel better after I eat. Mama said dinner's almost ready, huh? Yeah, let's see what Mama's cooking. I'm gonna leave you alone now. She's not cooking much by the looks of it. What a pleasant surprise. And okay, Martha. I was beginning to fear we'd seen the last of good company for a spell. Yet the Eternal provides, does it not? I certainly can't fault your optimism. And who could? Stretch out your hand and cosmic divinity reaches back. Open wide your mouth. And the universe provides sustenance. Uh-huh. What do you mean by that? Just that your presence here is a gift to us, and one that we don't take for granted. She's definitely looking Look at, me, at me like food. As if this gravy is going to cook itself. Why don't you run along until we are ready for dinner? Definitely gonna eat me. Where's the trap? You must be famished. So are we, my friend, but one can't rush a fine meal. Wait, the door's locked? Why is the door locked? Is it sticking again? I'm afraid nothing out here works the way it used to. There's a bit of a trick to jimmying it open. I'll see to it once we've finished dinner. No, you'll see to it now. Please, there's no need for incivility. Though I certainly understand how hunger sharpens the temper. I promise I'll get the door open once we've had our meal. Until then, why don't you stretch your legs a bit? A nice walk around the house will surely limber them up. Have you seen a man named Braxton? I'm afraid we don't get many visitors out here. The Raptodons and Marauders scare off all but the boldest. Are you sure you haven't seen Braxton? I heard he was delivering medicine to you. I'm sure I would remember something like that. Now please, try to relax. Undue stress tends to spoil the meal, you know. I'll keep myself occupied then. So what I'm looking at is this, which is attack, but like... That's dumb. That's just... I'm going to attack you now. So, prepare yourself. 
Now, I'm going to keep myself occupied. I mean, fortunately, this game always requires you... Like, well, it doesn't require, but... So many buttons will accidentally get your weapon back out again, so there's no point putting it away. Um, so no one cares, fortunately, if I'm waving around a giant sniper rifle anyway. So, I think I choose option D. I just... Don't announce it. Making me nervous. Ah, let's go. Everyone all right? Enemy killed. It says enemy. That confirms it. Keys and cartridges. All right. Level head. Adrenal suppressant liquid. Trip style. We got some booze. I'll have them now, I think. Right, what would we have found? Hi, Lizzie. Oh, hi there. Did you come to bring us more of those rocket candies? Oh, did she not hear that? Sure, I brought some candies. That's wonderful. There was this other man who used to bring them. Not anymore, though. Was his name Braxton by any chance? I don't know. I'm not really supposed to talk to strangers. Why isn't he bringing you more rocket candies himself? He said they were making us sick. Mom and Papa got real mad at him for that. They went to have a talk with him. Afterwards, they said he wasn't coming back again. I'm gonna go. Okay. Maybe I'll see you at dinner. Yes. That was real nice of her. Dinner. Inviting us to dinner like that. Uh... Spacer's choice pills, they cure all your ills. Uh Levi Mather's poetry journal. Sunrise. The sun crests the horizon as round, soft and warm. As the lump of a sissy pig, the day is fresh and alive with possibility. Trees. My life can grow. Sky, monarch, blah, blah, blah. Hunger. There we go. There is an ache sharp in my stomach. Hurts all the time. Food makes me sick. Water makes me sick. Always hungry, so I can't think. Okay. Do that in a bit. Ah, she left. Ah, there she is. What are you doing in my room? I came to the kitchen. Sorry, just looking around. Honest. Liar. You're trying to steal the last of my rocket candies, aren't you? Your rocket candies? The ones that come in a bottle with a rocket ship on it. Like the other man used to bring. Calm down. How do I distract her? Got to be something right. There we go. No, no. I am so. If lost, please return to Ballard Velma. Yeah. So glad I skipped lunch. Supper time. Oh, kill the family is a. Well, there we go. There we go. Ain't it handy how that worked out? <laughs> uh. 
What was I? It's here, yes. Supper time. Don't play with your food. Ooh. Okay. Interesting. Somebody off never felt so damn good. I mean, at least she never had to worry because she never knew it was coming. It just happened. God, being evil would be so much fun. <laughs> all right, all right. Ooh, another dead eye. I don't know what the special effect is. Bleed, stagger. Like, what is execute? Special effect. Like, nowhere does it actually explain what that means. I am curious. Very, very curious. Let's have a look. Small chance of eliminating the target. Okay. And stagger is going to be, yeah, push them back a little bit. Etc. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, might as well. Okay. Bye. What do we want to do? That's back at the fishery. Stop doing that. Probably don't want to just jump off. Eh, yeah, fuck it. <laughs> it's done now. Take the scenic route. It's outside of Edgewater. Used up, unneeded. Left to settle into ruin. Exploring some ruins, killing some monsters. All we're missing is theme music. Smells like those old Sundays when we'd unload salt tuna shipments at the can. Look at my muscle bros. I want to see some savages. All right. I think him and I are on the same page there. 
Join that. Did you know June Lai, grown up? Miss Tennyson? Nah, she never looked my way. I knew of her, though. Who didn't? She was just about the busiest woman on the groundbreaker. What did folks say about her then? Tough. Competent. Had a glare that'd stop you dead in your tracks. <laughs> All right. Nope, the person I want's in the back. Not that way. Not even that way. <laughs> Different goddamn factory. All right. Hey, Nell. Ooh, you're the new face. Wow, you must be up on all the latest tossball games. What? So who do you follow? Wait, don't tell me. You look like a Hammersmith Thunder fan. No, Glacial Age Mammoths. Uh, ooh, who's to say? Uh, ooh, hang on. Yes. I, uh, I actually play for Auntie Cleo's darlings. Don't you recognize me? Darlings? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> I mean, uh, yeah, you're looking at the darlings' newest recruit. Boss is a shoe in for Rookie the Quarter. I'd heard they'd gotten a new hacker. Is that why everyone's making such a fuss about you? But what are you doing on Monarch? Uh, part of a goodwill tour of Halcyon. We're meeting our fans across the colony. Maybe we're not so isolated as I thought. You get to listen to games all day? Stellar Bay really is a paradise. It's pretty swell, but it's a whole lot better with company. Say, I don't think I've seen you before, and I'd remember that face. I'll try not to be a stranger then. My name's Felix, by the way. Uh, yeah. You should stop by more often. The games are always better when you've got someone to celebrate with. Sounds like a good time. I wouldn't mind bringing a couple drinks and settling in for the pennant match. Look at me, getting carried away again. So, what can Fuck I do? Fuck already. Alright. Um, I found this betting slip in a dead man's apartment. Any idea what might have happened to him? Poor Isaac. I was wondering why I hadn't seen him in a few days. I'd really like to help. Isaac was a sweet fellow, even if he did have terrible teeth. Oh my. Uh, yep, yeah, I'm listening. Right, so the thing with Isaac is he didn't know where to stop. He'd get stuck on something and he just couldn't let it go. Sometimes he'd drink Purpleberry Punch by the leader. Other times he'd keep betting on a losing team. Started owing the wrong people money. So who did he owe? I don't know for sure, but I saw Elijah and his buddies pushing Isaac around. They're hooligans from Fallbrook. They sweep into town, drop supplies off behind the warehouse, and spend the rest of their stay getting rowdy over tossball games. Uh huh. They usually loiter in the alley behind the yacht club. They're not allowed in the bar anymore. I bet you anything Isaac ran into trouble with one of them. Uh, thanks for the tip. Mr. Sanjar will be pleased to hear about it when you're done. I know he gets fed up with the Fallbrook bullies, but there's not much he can do. Uh, okay. Let's go do that then, I guess. Or while we're here. Let's hand that in. Which is... That way. Uh... Which is that way. 
This way. I think. Yeah. Hi, Velma. I'd give you a friendlier welcome, but I'm up to my elbows and salt tuna guts. Gosh, this old girl's in a rough way. Even old Bess in Edgewater was in better shape than this. Hey, you want to try running a cannery with obsolete machinery? You be my guest. Um, sorry, ma'am. I wasn't trying to be rude. It's just your flanging apparatus isn't making a strong flange. You so want now? Sealer isn't sealing right, and oh, I see what you're saying. Huh? I'll have to try that. Huh. Anyway, what do you folks need? Uh, bad news about Braxton. That he's got his load on and I'm stuck covering his shift? Eh. Killed by cannibals. That's... Wow. I sure feel like an ass now. Uh. Cheer up. No, it's a rotten way to go. Yeah, I wouldn't wish that on Catherine herself. Still... It's good to know what happened to him. And that I ought to start looking for a replacement. Mm-hmm. Something else on your mind? Uh... You said Braxton had been stealing drugs? Stealing's such a nasty word. Let's call it skimming. And yeah, let's just say I've noticed the sterile biotics we used for the fish would get used a little faster on Braxton's shifts. Awfully nice of you not to say anything. We're not like those corporate towns where you get fined for sleeping on the wrong side of the bed. Besides, the Spacer's Choice stuff we use is cheap enough. And Braxton knows how to get the Saltuna, fat and mostly tumor free. Or new, I guess. All right, waiters. Where are we going for that, actually? Actually, oh, in town. All right. Simple enough. Where are we going? What are the chances of all the times and places we could have been born? Shush. Yeah. So what did you think of the game last night? I still can't believe Armstrong ran the field from the uh, Tuesday zone. No matter where I go, yeah. people try and talk Armstrong's sports ball to me. Really something. Really took a or around me. Clean off with a toss ball stick. Yeah, well, he's a hacker. That's what they do. Rangers don't show a shred of mercy in a Darlings game. Bates got tossed out of the game for excessive sportsmanlike conduct in the third half. <laughs> Serves him right. Yeah. Um, excessive yeah, sportsmanlike. I don't know what a Tuesday zone is. I don't know my tenders from my forwards. Thing is, I just don't understand toss ball. You and me both. Hey, that's fine. Nothing wrong with that. I'll teach you all there is to know. Oh, well, dear. Uh, right, no. That's just no, well. that is never the answer. Wait. Who the fuck are you? This ain't your alley. Shut up, Berta. Berta. Hey. What are you doing here? This is our secret alley. Berta already pissed by those crates to market. Berta. I know you murdered Isaac. Listen, that purple tooth twerp had it coming. Not that anyone has proof. And not that it's any of your business. I'm making it my business. Oh yeah? What are you saying exactly? You've bullied people long enough. If you know what's good for you, you'll clear out and never come back. Wow. Most of the pencil pushers around here cave as soon as you look at them funny. Fine. We're going. Damn. This ain't I was hoping it. he'd say no and start a fight. <laughs> Jesus, every time. Uh, okay. Kind of want more lockpick. 
With a little bit more, I'll have a hundred. Five there. Four there. I have over a hundred persuade. Holy shit. All right. Ah. Well, that's hilarious. Uh Ooh, high level determination seems pretty good. Well, for now. And... That's when loan. I've already got that. A headshot. 20%? Probably. Maybe that too. Restored per kill. When using it, extra damage. Right, they just go together, right? Let's get that first. We're what, level 18 now? So killing restores it now. Alright. Ooh. Yoink. Don't mind if I do. Guess we can go and hand that in. Hi, buddy. Aha, the helpful stranger I've heard so much about. Here to do business, hmm? Uh huh. Here's my schedule. This newcomer has a meeting with me. What? No, you have a meeting with me. Did you hear that power play, Celia? They don't make them like this anymore in Halcyon. I only hope you don't judge me by my handshake. Oh, I will. Now, what business brings you here? Uh, I'm just looking for the information broker. Hiram? Why, he's probably still out at Devil's Peak. Apparently, Not I that am. he's had the courtesy to notify me, at any rate. But if you're here for him, I suppose that means you aren't here for Saltuna. Hell no. Uh... <laughs> If I have to eat one more weird science project passed off as food in this sprat fucked colony, I, I am, am genuinely going to stab someone. Yes, that's it. Channel your anger. I only wish I could do the same. <laughs> Seems like you're having a rough time, Mr. Sanjar. Are you doing quite all right? Oh, don't worry on my account. This is merely the latest in a long line of professional erotic and athletic disappointments. Uh, I had hoped that livening up our advertisements with enticing figures would draw the other corporations back to our bosom, but it seems we're back to the drawing board. What exactly are you hoping to accomplish? Thanks to the so-called hazard clause, Monarch has been cut off from the board's resources and protection for ten years now. Now, we've kept ourselves in business by trading with individual corporations, but given the off-the-books nature of those transactions, such arrangements are precarious. Hmm. And you're tired of scrounging and scraping by her. Yes. Freedom is a tempting ideal, but a rather costly paramour. Sure. Can't imagine why you'd sneer at the notion of a free colony. 
Could it be because you're an agent of the establishment? Yeah. Could it be? I used to be young and idealistic too, but you can't run a city on high-minded ideals. Mm. So what do you mean to do about it? Well, Mr. Nandi here has a rather ingenious plan to get MSI restored to the board. On our terms, mind you. But will that help the people here, Mr. Sanjar? Keep them fed and safe? That's precisely what I'm trying to do. Is it? And if our advertising scheme hasn't borne fruit, then perhaps it's time we took matters into our own hands. Enough preamble. What's the plan? It's a two-pronged approach. The first part involves seeing Stellar Bay properly defended. Uh, fine, but how do you mean to do it? With a Bolt 52 cartridge, of course. If you can get us what we need to rejoin the board, starting the Bolt 52, we'll be able to become one of the most productive what? and secure cities in Halcyon. And you'll have a powerful ally on the board. Sounds useful. What is it? Why, one of the strongest defenses in Halcyon. An extremely powerful ordinance. I was starting to get bored listening to you until you said the phrase extremely powerful yeah, same. ordinance. Yes, same. Same. Felix. Quite the I get you, Felix. <laughs> uh, oh, I love that. If I had one intelligence. Or, wait, or is it high intelligence? No, it's first answer. It doesn't say what the score is, though. Anyway. Uh, what's the other part of your plan? I'll need to gather some supplemental materials, but I mustn't get ahead of myself. You do tend to do that. The Bolt 52 will be in the old arms building southwest of town, which used to be part of Stellar Bay before we had to move our walls in. And these days, it's overrun with marauders and raptodons. Pretty much where I just went, I guess. Why are you saying it that way? Saying what? Which way? Come on. Arms. You're saying arms instead of arms. That's just what it's called. It's supposed to stand for something, but I forget what. No, you don't. Fine, I'll see what I can do. Good enough. I know when to settle. Oh, and while you're at it, there should be a terminal in the arms building with some dangerous information. Perhaps you could delete it so it doesn't I'll fall be taking that information, hand. yes. I will store it. For blackmail. <laughs> Uh, have what we got anything else to ask? There we go. Isaac Rose is dead. I found the people who killed him. But that's terrible. What happened? It was Elijah and his hooligan friends. I already dealt with it. I'm glad to hear you've dealt with them. They've been causing quite a bit of trouble around town. I've been consumed with other matters of late, but I would have dealt with them. Eventually. Uh, of course. Of course I would have. Still, your intervention in the matter is much appreciated. Please consider this payment for your services. Uh, I met Grim. I see. And was his delivery of the MSI authorized greeting up to snuff? Did a bang up job. Well, that's excellent. I'll see that your feedback makes it into his review. What else can I do for you? Uh, laters. Alright. So, probably just gonna keep this weapon. So, here's the thing about Taskbar. Ah. Uh, played from the heart. Felix. Okay, I'm with you so far. Play from the heart. Easy. There are other schools of thought. Some say you gotta use your head to play Taskbar. Those people have concussions. Oh, Bravo. Gosh. That sounds um really dangerous. Toss balls a celebration of danger. Take the hacker. The hacker's job is to trample right through the enemy's defense. Best hacker in the league's fella by the name of Take It Easy Tatum. 50 uh. injuries to his name in 3 non-consecutive seasons. Why do they call him Take It Easy Tatum? Oh, that's what the mediators used to shout out every time he'd go into a bloodthirsty frenzy. 
Looking a little bit stiff, guys. Oh, we good? Are we done? Story over. Okay. Wait. Eh, uh, bollocks. See the rider is wrong. Wait. No. I'm sure he said south, right? Oh, please say I haven't done unnecessary load. That's the worst part. Whoa. No, we're looking all right. Here's the other thing about Tospel. Tospel is all about scoring goals. Scoring goals. Got it. And you can score a goal by kicking the ball, throwing the ball, or, uh, or running it into the Saturday. I see you. If you're a visitor, or the soul. Goal if you're on the home team. Okay, so if you're on the home team, you want to run the ball into the Sunday goal. Makes uh, perfect sense. Yeah. No, it doesn't. You can also kick it. That's called a foot goal. Or throw it. That's called a hand goal. Running's worth more points, but it's got some risks. Clean, Dead. Packed, Dead. Bronze. You could tumble the ball in the Wednesday zone. Also known as getting humped. Felix, are we still talking about toss ball or? Uh, well, yeah. What'd you think we were talking about? Just hidden. Damn it. Show yourself, you son bitch. God damn it, guys. Can we do that again? Yeah, get fucked. Got it. Heads down. Dunzo. That'll do it. All right, we should be good. For now. Yep, didn't even fall over. Trick shot, Gio. Someone or something. Oh, hey. I love a good bra. Get out of the fucking way. Get down. Woo! Are we good? We're all very concussed again, but it's kind of just par for the course around here lately. Damn it. Oh shit. Come on. Don't mess with us. Got him. This building looks like Nope. Right, here we go. Nope. Where go, oh hell no. Everyone all right? Hell nope. I 
I see you, Colossus. You know what? Execute. Ow. Exceptionally rude. Ow. Get him. Is that it? I think we're good. Nom 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 nom. Alrighty. I think we got it. Uh, don't have the key. Don't need it. In fact, arguably better off not using it. Don't know, maybe they balanced it in this. But usually in these kind of games you get end up getting more XP for breaking into shit and just opening it. Biddies. Hallows. A few reviews. Uh, executive review for Sanjar Nandi. Right. Uh, Sanjar has a bad habit of padding his reports with numbers and statistics. Not very good with slogans, jingles and or taglines. Presentations tend to be dry and lacking in emotional appeal and funny references. Wow. All right. Sanjar also displays a noted tendency to complete work rather than delegating it. A trend unbecoming in upper management. All in all, Sanjar's work habits suggest a preoccupation with details and a startling lack of vision. We cannot recommend him for further advancement. Needs improvement in the following areas. Interpersonal communication. Brevity. Delegation. Idea generation. I'm not deleting all of them. Graham Bryant. Spoof logging credentials. Graham's understanding of product messaging and branding is impressive, especially for a relatively low-level editor. Has a knack for memorable slogans and taglines. However, Graham has issues with brevity and shows consistent disregard for prescribed fonts and formats. Some of his work has been flagged for subversive undertones. Wow, alright. Dora Erickson. Dora shows a real knack for brief but compelling presentations supported by catchy slogans. Her delegation skills are also top-notch. She can build a lengthy meeting around any topic and emerge with plenty of work assigned. Recommend for promotion. Ugh. Is there no option to keep them? Uh, I'm going to leave it for now. May do it later. Grenade Launcher 2. The sequel. 412. I mean... Yeah. Why would I not? What are you... Alright guys, calm down. It's the smallest jump ever. Ooh, I can see what's inside first. I forgot about that. Bonus. I mean, it's kind of pointless because I'm going to loot it all anyway. We 
Doop doop do doop do. Oh, it's so tempting. I don't think they've figured that out yet. Who are you? Oh, thank the Eternal. I'm Huxley. Ah, uh, Hux, if you're lazy. I'm stuck. Uh huh. My friends and I were scavenging here, and a Mad Queen showed up. Then Raptodon, who's a void blast mess. I ran in here, and um, now the door's locked. Little help? Uh, you how what how, how yeah how how? It's easier than it sounds, all right. Next time you get chased by raptodons, you let me know the rationality of your decisions. All right. Well, I need in there. Phew. Thanks, Mister. My buddy had a key, but I ain't heard him in a while. He locked me in here and took off. Probably got munched. So look for a dead guy, I guess, or a rat. Maybe it's in a rat belly. Gross. Ooh, if only. Must be a way to open it from the inside. What do you mean? It's locked. Right, but... Okay, let's try the handle. Turn it upward and... Yeah, I'm not searching all the fucking raptodons. You moron. Thank you so much. It was getting all stuffy in there, and I was getting a mite lightheaded, and I think maybe I was gonna die. <laughs> now I'm out here. And I'm headed back to Amber Heights. Iconoclast, okay. You sure you're okay? Oh, sure, I'm a runner. I'm used to getting all dizzy, and <laughs> hey, who's your identical, slightly blurry friend? Very good. Very good. Okay, good luck. Thanks a lot, mister. Well done. Yes. How, how to use door handles. Anyway. All the monies. All the monies. Holy shit. She didn't think maybe I'll take the monies with me. Thank God for idiots. <laughs> What is it? What actually is it? Must have a lot of data. Right, can I copy that information onto this and then can I plug it into my computer? On my ship? Wait, or was it up here? No. It's here, wasn't it? Sure. Space crime. Let's hand in. Connect. There we go. Just going to try it. I don't think it's going to work, but... I would like to know either way. Why was I built to feel ennui? Uh. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? No. Nope. Take care. I require a functioning captain to run the ship. Okay, I don't know where I'd plug that in. Mm -hmm. 
Whoops. Yeah, I guess not. Although while I'm here. What have I got? That can go in there. Think. Rest of that's good. How? That's what I wanted. Can I swap these? Get rid of that. Oh, I can put something else in the first slot. No, I can't. Alright, I really don't understand this then. Wait, activates all slotted consumables simultaneously. Wait, all simultaneously? I've been thinking about this all wrong. That's some regen. Oh shit. So then what I actually want is something like that. Adrena time. What have I got a shit ton of? Okay, okay, this this just got more interesting. Sniper, crit damage. Well there we go. Now I need that extra slot, eh? Wait, none of that's in there, is it? Oh shit, it is. Give me drugs. Ambidextrine. Melee weapons don't need that. Base health, base health. Mind. Call down. Need some of them. Focus it all. Okay. Armor. Ideally, I want, I want the stuff that uh, I have lots of, right? Can I just get rid of the not useful shit? Ah, whatever. Is there a sort? There is no sort. Wait, what? what? Mm. Get rid of them. I have ambidextrine as well, but there was one I had loads of. Oh no, I didn't have loads. Alright, never mind. But I have some. Okay, it took me a while, but I've got it, I think, with that whole thing. I didn't realise it did all of them at the same time. Um, game changer. Okay. That's fine. That is fine.
Okay. Ooh, nearly. Nearly. Okay. Calm down. Hey, Grim. Oh, good news. Show you around, but I gotta keep watch. Okay, he doesn't care. Hi. Now, if we were like the other corporations, you wouldn't be allowed to run around dressed like one of Graham's minions. Who? But we're better than that. See? Anyway, they what haven't stopped me you? either, but okay. I found your review. You weren't supposed to look. I asked you to delete it. Um, sorry, it was already open, honest. Oh, yes. No doubt someone else was having a laugh at my expense before you. This has been my albatross. The great shame of my career. I give MSI everything. My work, my youth, my left kidney, and for years, I was a joke to them. Your left kidney? Uh, one of the executives required a transplant. I thought volunteering to donate might improve my Oh, prospects. you fool. You're insane. No, I am a company man. Yeah, that's what you get for giving so much of yourself over to a corporation. Oh, perhaps they were right. After all, what have I built? Stellar Bay is barely keeping afloat. Take it easy. City's running against all odds. I hadn't thought of it that way. But perhaps there's something to that. Thank you for that. Or was there something else? Uh, here's the cartridge. And I did delete the data. Oh, yes. I'm going After to reading all it, night with obviously. This. All those blanks waiting to be filled, boxes waiting to be ticked. Try to control yourself, sir. Have you any idea Big how powerful XP for this that. is? Corporations have been toppled with less. How exactly is a data cartridge going to help? What a question! Bureaucratic micromanagement is the only way anything gets done in Halcyon, and proper documentation is a key part of that. For our part, a bill of liquidation slash transfer form 52 will protect our holdings on Monarch by temporarily assigning them to a pass-through entity once we drop our bomb on the board. Uh, finally, yeah, they get their comeuppance. Wait, we're dropping a bomb on the board? Sort of. Really, we're just going to blackmail them into offering us a seat at the table. But really... Whatever gets you excited about the idea. It's definitely a firm middle finger. Sure. I can get behind that. That's what I like to hear. I have reason to believe that one of the other corporations is operating of course, on Monarch. Illegally, if he becomes one of them, I will just shoot him in the head. Or so just can't let Monarch go, huh? If we can find proof, I can use that as leverage to encourage certain powers that be to accept our Bolt 52 and reinstate us on the board. All right, so what for me? If someone is operating here, then Catherine's almost certainly supplying them out of Fallbrook. Perhaps she could be convinced to tell you where they are. Uh, actually, I already found that info, so... Already? <laughs> if only the rest of the colony operated as efficiently as you. Imagine what a different state we'd be in, hmm? I'll complete the Bolt 52 in no time. I dare say it'll be my second greatest achievement after the reformations. You're getting ahead of yourself again. So I am. Do you have this cartridge? Wait, what are these reformations? I'm working on a plan to reorganize the board. Slowly, peacefully, and with meticulous documentation. What's going to happen to the people here when the board figures out what you're doing? Well, 
By that point, my hope is that we'll be on the board once more. I'm just... Maybe I'm worrying too much, but it seems the folks here get plans made for them an awful lot. Yeah. They get to start making plans for themselves. Once MSI is restored, the people of Monarch will be able to make more choices. We'll have all the brands and resources of the board here. But truly, I am getting ahead of myself. First, I need to submit the Vault 52. With that data you're holding, of course. Mm, maybe I don't. I, I don't understand. Where is it? Not so fun having someone jerk your chain, is it? Is this about the Bolt 52? Please, I, I wasn't trying to mislead you. Anyway, I don't think I can handle this back and forth. I'm used to crushing disappointment, but not after having reason to hope. That makes it all considerably worse. I guess I've got to give it to him. All right, have it. I knew there was something going on. This is exactly the proof we need. The board will have to welcome us got back. Stuck in there. I'll transmit this data along with the completed Bolt 52 right away. After that, we'll sit back and quietly wait for the board to respond. That means no more broadcasts from us. Alright. I have, like, some MSI armor and shit. Ranged weapon skills. Ooh. Oh, it is pretty badass. Did I turn helmets off? Or is that just a default thing? Uh, I don't need to see companion helmets. Yeah, alright. I can be on board with this. Probably way less sneaky. Long guns specifically plus seven. Silver tongue. Dialogue leadership. Eh. Uh, no, we stick with that. After all. Damaged creatures. Medical. Inspiration. We're looking pretty cool. Uh, yeah, our int is pretty high. Our temperament isn't. All right. What are we looking at? Groundbreaker. You ever seen a real life Saltuna? What do you mean live? Saltuna comes in cans? Felix, Saltuna is a kind of fish. Lives in the ocean. You knew that. Wait. Are you serious? You tell me there's a fish made entirely out of Saltuna? Never mind. I'll tell you later. Are you actually a moron? I think he's actually a moron. Okay. Damn, tried to leave him. Let's go. Hmm. 
Boop, doop, doo. Warning, intruders will be, oh, it's you. Maybe I give one of them the pimping armor. Heavy weapons. Sneak bonus. Why would, why would I leave him with sneak bonus? Give him a skill. Corporate military. <sighs> Tempting thematically at the very least. Sneaky. Sure. I'll take that for interest alone. What's she got? Block and stealth. That's about ranged weapon skills. Maybe I save them. Someone who's a ranged weapon specialist. I've still got two more slots on the, on the team, right? So, um, get rid of that. Wait, if I break it down, there's a chance of recovering, right? Got a bonus. Bolter pistol seems pretty good. I should really just take off that mind control ray. Uh, yeah, I think I do. May as well keep that. You can go in there, you can go in there, and you. And I guess you and you. They're gone. I think we're good. Yeah, and then we'll go to Scylla. Which is up over there. But first of all... If only that was the actual load time, right? If only. Guess I'll have to take Max on the next bit as well. I could put him in big armor? Huh. Maybe. Definite maybe. Oh, I should have kept one of the old big machine guns that I had kicking around. Giving it to Max or some shit. I don't know. Don't know what he has in terms of stat spreads and whatnot. Always an impressive view. Alright. Um, I completely forget who we're here to talk to. It's in like, inside sublight, yeah. Or 
also can't remember how I get up there. Lift. Dead giveaway. Hey guys. Ah, this is Delia. That gas is going to make us a fucking mint. 120 some cubic meters of it. Not a million bits a pop. Take this. You've earned it. Yeah, boy. When we get buyers lined up, I'm gonna buy a gold toilet to shit in. Ooh, you're not the only one who enjoys the finer things, Lilia. You? you know what? Fuck it. Enjoy yourself. Thank I you. Invest in the happiness of my workers, and you deserve a bigger cut. Monarch isn't exactly a walk down the lanes of Byzantium, but here you are with all your limbs attached. Call me impressed, contractor. In case you're curious, no one was following me. No one you saw, anyway. Glad to see you're looking out for yourself. You've been keeping busy. I hear you took on some extra work at Fallbrook. Catherine sounds pleased as a pig in shit over cornering the Borst markets. Hey, when you were at the slaughterhouse, those swine didn't give you any strange looks, did they? Like what? I could have sworn one of them winked at me. I knew it. I'm probably getting worked up over nothing. Just try not to think about pigs. What is he doing? You never know, you know. Are you doing okay? I've got a lot on my mind, but it's nothing that concerns you. At least, not yet. I have another job lined up. Assuming you're still interested in work, they're gonna salvage me a space Ooh. station. Heliospheric Research Station 1084, to be exact. I want it. Cobwebs and all. Interested? Uh, take over a whole space station? I could be convinced. This be great. Oh, do we get to stick a flag in the ground? This opportunity won't come around again, Captain. Uh, just point me in the right direction. Here, this override bypass should get you into the station systems where you can plant my flag. And one last thing. When you get there, make sure you aren't followed. We wouldn't want that. Sure. I'm on the heels of something big. Play your cards right and I'll clue you in. But right now, I'm not sure who I can trust. Just be careful. Someone might try and use you to get to me. Whoa. There we go. Big XPs for all that. Oh, 116 persuade. Holy shit. Uh, yeah, don't want to put anything else in there, that's for sure. Five, six, seven, eight. Lockpick 100. Do I want hack? I mean, I really want long guns. Alright. It's pretty good. The Ice Palace. Uh, do I want to go do these first? I think so. Let's go do that first. And find a new place. In fact, can I just... Do that, I guess. Right?
Uh, your face is a site for sore ocular processors, Captain. Or rather, your headgear is. Thank you. I guess. Um. Actually, you know what? I never upgraded upgraded his Mark II grenade launcher. I should do that. Although that was downstairs. Ah! <laughs> uh, okay. I need to get my parts. Permanently crippled. It's not worth it. I don't want to be a cripple. God damn it. Ah, we'll keep that for now. All right. All right, all right. In fact, Raptor Prod, special thing, so we'll leave that on. It's fun. Should I give her the option of doing either? If you can max as a flamethrower. Which is what it is. The prismatic hammer. And Sam, I can't adjust. Take that for sure. Give that to her. Mixed. Uh, I think they're fine. Yeah, she can live with that. So I should upgrade her MacGuffin. MacGuffin. Uh, Felix, no. Vicar. I think as fun as that is, I am actually going to swap it out for that. Uh, I'll be back there anyway. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Speed. Durability. No point going durability. Power for plasma, N ray. Power damage. Let's do some of that. Uh, still got the officer's spine. Bolt pistol, silencer, no. Wait, that is. That is normal. No, I'm not changing it to shock. Or increasing the mag size. Or doing that. That's not happening. Grenade launch 2, however. Also, how do you silence a fucking grenade launcher? That's, anyway. Shock grenade launcher? Hmm... Actually tempting. Yeah. Uh May as well, right? Do I really want to upgrade? 
This one, really. That was worth it to me. <laughs> I could just keep these weapons maxed out. Ah, that's going to be expensive. Let's leave that for now. But... Level 20. If we're going to keep this armor, I may as well make it good. Alright. While we're at it. Engineering bonus. Probably also pointless. Just heavy. Better than... Yeah. Science. Do I get any bonus for that? I guess so. I just can't. Alright, well, whatever. Consider that a success for now. Dump the stuff back in and move on to Ilya. Wait, there's press pristine versions of these, really? Temporarily invulner invulnerable. I'll leave it for now. Let's journey on. Scylla, not Ilya. That's right. Destination reached. Scylla. Except we still have the load. Big load. Uh, that's max. So we take... Max and someone. Felix? I kind of like taking Parvati though. But we did just upgrade his grenade launcher. Hot. Grenade launcher and flamethrower. Ah, fuck it. I probably should put him in big armor too. Uh, um. Come on. Yeah, I, I need to swap over that HDMI. I think it's a problem. Keep getting that crackling. Not often, but... Or maybe... Uh, I might just... I might have another idea. Uh, anyway, I haven't been there, so I can't fast travel. Irian ship. Wait, have I been here? Been to that thing, right? Shh. Yeah, that wasn't loud. Ow. Alright, freebies. Welcome to the planet. Ooh. 
Ooh, hello. Oof. Get dead. That has a hurt. Don't mess with us. I do enjoy killing people from across most of the map. People, enemies. Oh, I've got the bonus creature damage now, haven't I? That's right. God, this thing's a beast. How about I just... I wonder what hit him. Doesn't know where I am. Assassinated. Despite the volume. No one noticed. Sniper, you say? Think that got him. Oh. We good? I think we good. Where's the robot I launched? There we go. Don't see anybody else. I heard something. Got it. Good night. It's dealt with. Hello? You too? Yep. Uh, Behemoth? This might be... What? They shouldn't have stood in our way. You'll you'll get to join in the fight one day, lads. One day. Uh what's We're getting close to the hermit. I can feel it. Maybe it's haunted. We should look around. Oh hello. Drones, you say? I'll do it. Subtle work, Captain. I think I do more damage during the time dilation. Certainly seems that way. Oh shit. That fires a lot faster. Alright. Think we're good? Did I find this? Uh, I want to spare one of those. Rest of that's kind of whatever. Shot cannon ultra. <sighs> Tempting. <laughs> Calm down. What, what are you doing? Mandibular rearranger. I accidentally found. Wait. Mm hmm. There we go. Mandibular rearranger. 
was created by an unknown and possibly quite deranged scientist. Exactly how it works and why is a mystery and it has never been duplicated. What's it do? 14k XP though. Alright. No. DPS is pretty bad. Well, we've got it either way. Messages. Uh, we've completed our initial survey, and I have to admit that your hunch was right. I owe you lunch next time I'm on Terra 1. We barely started our survey before we uncovered a mineral vein with high densities of yttrium and scandium. There's a limit to how much my team can extract in these pressure suits. Get us a terraformer and some prospecting me uh, mechanicals, and this little venture of ours is going to make us all rich. Hope the weather on Terra 1 isn't getting you down. I hear our permanent facility on Hephaestus is almost ready for habitation. Uh, day 127. Thanks for rushing us that replacement part, Linda. My team got the former repaired, and it's... Oh, abbreviation of Terraformer, got it. Uh, and it's busy churning out O2 again. Did you have to send one loaded with seed stock? Damn grasses are trigger triggering my allergies. Survey efforts continue. That initial vein ran dry quicker than we hoped, but we're getting promising results from other locations. Density of scandium lower than first sight, but yttrium still at respectable levels. Uh, we had a board team out here last week scanning for signals from the Hope. Wait, that was the ship I was on, right? We could all guess the results from how unhappy they looked. It's been three years since the board classified the ship as missing. You'd think we'd be over it by now. So they were looking. Lost, lost stock, I guess. Uh, congratulations on your promotion. Youngest full VP in comp company history. Just promise me you won't promote that drill bit Needham to replace you. Bad news, Lynn. All the sites within the farmers, former's dome have run dry. Um, the mechanicals are bringing back good samples from beyond the retention field. I'll be sending you a requisition for a hauler to relocate the terraformer closer to the new sites. Wait, terrafo terraform's only a small area? Um, my team heard that you arranged for some circus time traveling show? What? To stop at our base. It was a big boost to morale. I can't wait for some entertainment out here. Uh, Thackeray, your request for site relocation on that useless rock is denied. You've had over a year to generate a profit. If you haven't done it by now, it's not going to happen. And Evers is too busy to hide your incompetence. I don't want to hear any of your absurd excuses either. The terraformer failure was bad enough, but this drivel about primals running loose and damaging your equipment is the limit. The utter limit, do you hear? Operations at your site are terminated. Effective immediately. I've got a new site in mind for you. One of the rocks orbiting Hephaestus. Temps are a cool 170 degrees C. You'll love it. Happy birthday, Julia. Uh, a visiting board team reminded me of the date. We should be celebrating your 42nd birthday today. I try and get you drunk with the latest Rizzo's co concoction. Uh, you turn up your nose and say it was nowhere near as good as an earth wine. I don't know where you are, big sis. It's been 13 years since you entered hibernation. Oh, wow, okay. Uh, since the hope started its journey. I don't know what happened, why you never got here. If the architect is kind, you didn't suffer. Think about you all the time. Every time one of the big interstellar conveyors blazes past, I look up and hope. Hope? Whoever named that damn ship should take a walk in the ether. I'm so sorry. I never should have convinced you to sign the indenture contract and join me on Halcyon. I'll never stop thinking about you, Jules. Please forgive me. Jules. Ask about Sublight. Uh, ask Linda for info on this Sublight company. That freight captain claimed to work for them. Very strange ship. No corporate branding or colours. The captain didn't wear an approved uniform. Dealing with him left me feeling out of sorts. Had some interesting items for sale, though. Can't shake the feeling that they... Fell off the back of a conveyor. That captain sold Harris something called the Rear Ranger. That's the weapon I got, I guess. Then left before we discovered the damn thing doesn't work. 
Only thing it rearranged is the number of bits on Harris's card. Looks like some strange tech. Maybe a scientist can make something of it? I kind of want to use it. But I have no... Real affinity for um, melee weapons on this character. Three and three. I guess raw damage would still be there, but... Transition to Lodge. Hmm. Oh, hello. What have the solar winds deposited on my doorstep now? Just more dirt and debris? Or do you actually believe you are here seeking the truth? I must admit, I tire of the truth seekers. Mayhaps you're here to rob me? That would be so much more huh. exciting. Uh, we're here to get this book translated. Max? We've been told this was once yours. I believe the knowledge within here contains the answers I seek. Answers that will free men's minds from toil. I can translate it, but it won't do you any good. I can see you are a man in a hurry, and the insights in that book would take you years of study to fully comprehend. I have spent my life in contemplation. I believe my mind is prepared to receive the truth. I, do, I doubt it, yeah. Uh, we've come a long way to help Max get some peace. Is there anything you can do to help? There is one way that can speed up the process. It involves a combination of several ingredients, some of which can be fatal. It is not for the faint of heart or the unprepared. Um, you mean drugs, right? A crass way to put it, but yes. Chemicals that can expand or destroy the participant's consciousness. Uh, Max just said he was prepared, didn't he? And I believe he may be right. There is both violence and peace warring inside you, Max. This process would be extremely tenuous for one such as yourself. I'm committed, no matter the cost. No matter the cost. <laughs> it's just drugs, Max. We ain't making you walk in front of a firing squad. <laughs> I'm committed to taking as many drugs as possible, so count me in as well. All right. Head on into the meditation room and partake of the sacramental incense. Uh -huh. It's waiting on the table when you're ready to begin. Medita meditative aid, yes. Sure. Let's have a... Ooh, pretty room. Hold to breathe deeply. Ooh. Oh. Wait, what? Haven't you figured out yet that the more you fight, the more pain you cause yourself? Mother. How are we seeing his mother? Can't be here. I knew this was too good to be true. These are just cheap hallucinogens that have... What's happening to my voice? Does my voice sound weird to you? And what's wrong with your face? <laughs> What's wrong, Max? Can't think straight? Now you know how I feel. Uh, wait, forget I said that. <laughs> uh, your mother's right, Max. We should listen to her. No, if she's a hallucination, why am I seeing her too? We 
are obviously the victims of a tasteless joke being perpetuated. Uh, uh, perpetrated? Uh, I mean, we're being made fools of, aren't we? When I get out of here, I'm going to show that hermit what you get for messing with me. Maximilian, always ready to give up, to lash out. Always searching for answers, but always in the wrong place. Never looking inside himself. You look inside yourself all the time, Max. Or with your head buried up your posterior. Snacks. Say that. I only wanted you and father to be proud of me. I was going to be the perfect vessel. I was going to be a better, uh, more full of the plan. This here, it, it's all coming out wrong. The plan. It filled you with a joy I could never feel. I wanted it. And being a laborer made me miserable. I was better than that. You certainly convinced yourself you were. But don't feel bad. We continually lie to ourselves, weaving stories in a vain attempt to convince us that we are in control of anything. These stories are how we try to make sense of our lives, but they are not real, are they? They're just stories. You need to drop your story and see the truth. I got your story right here. I'm Vicar Max. I'm uptight. I love the church, and I'm a stooge for the board. And I don't understand that Felix is a genius. wanted to prove to my parents that I... that... I, damn it. You're right. Max, you need to lay the past to rest. What happened with your father and I, it's long dead. To attain your goals, you must live the chaos. Be fine with the chaos. Whether you resist or not, it will take you wherever it wants. More assuredly than even the fictional architect's plan you slave away to prove. No, that's not true. The basis of everything is order, not chaos. It's true, I know it is. So did you. Why are you denying it? Before you died, the plan made you happy. No, it didn't. I made myself happy. There's nothing holding you back but you. If you can't understand that, you will never understand anything. Goodbye, Maximilian. This whole thing, it's... it's... it's just a farce, right? Just... just my own brain working against me? You couldn't be more right. Hello, Max. What? Who... Why do you look like me? Are you me? Not really. I'm who you think you are. I am disciplined, controlled. I have no doubts, and I don't exist. Yet you have judged yourself against me your whole life. Why? Why do you berate yourself for not being me? Yeah, Max, why do you do that? Thank you. 
don't know what to say. Thank you, Captain, but I just... I don't know. Is it wrong to try to be a gooder, better person than I am? But that's not what you're doing, is it? You're desperately trying to find a story to organize reality in your head. A story to control everything. A new story of the happy you. The contented you. Me. That's not... It can't be right. I, I've only been searching for the answer to the equation. Because it will set us free. Won't it? How? By removing the need to make any decision. To have your life completely controlled. The illusion of certainty. Your obsession allowed you to avoid the real question. Who are you? I'm Max. Me! I'm real! You can't convince me otherwise! Please don't convince me I'm not. The concept of Max is what's not real. By the architect. Architect? How could I have believed in an architect? That's ridiculous. I must be losing my mind completely. What you're saying almost makes sense. We exist inside our thoughts, thinking we're in control. That's it, isn't it? We have no control over anything. It's all lies. How could I not have seen this? But how do we escape our... ourselves? I see you're back with us. Feared we lost you there. Never seen anyone pass out yet stay upright before. I... woke up. The illusions I built for myself just fell away. I'm no longer interpreting, I'm... experiencing. Everything... is perfect. In a way, perhaps it's more accurate to say I was asking the wrong questions. I understand so much more now. I see it all. All there is to be experienced, to be lived. Of course there is pain and loss, but the suffering is caused by trying to control reality. Clinging to the way you want things to be, not enjoying the way they are. I am content. I've finally found what I was looking for, even though I was looking for the wrong thing. Hmm, okay. That's better. I was getting real hungry. Um, but that seems to have taken the edge off a little bit. Around there, I think. Okay, so. Um, Max has 
I had a giant mood swing. I don't know why it wanted me to attack the ghost. I wasn't feeling it, though. I don't know, maybe he's secretly been brainwashed. I, I seemed like maybe he was just having a revelation. So, have you found your answers? Not so much found as finally listened. Yes, it is quite the convoluted maze we build for ourselves. Existence is simpler with your eyes closed. It takes courage to open them. It looks like you learned something in there as well. Nope, I already knew that. I was just enjoying myself. Of course you were. Alright, let's go. Let's be gone. Side note, Pringles, great. <laughs> Definitely addictive like crack. Not that I've tried crack, but you know. Just leaves the ice palace, I guess. Back to the ship for now. That was efficient planeting. Alright. You know what? You know what? I'm just gonna. In fact, if I'd known how close we were to at the end of that, I would have I would have waited because I'm gonna call it now before starting that next mission. It's all it's a work night. Oh, and I know tomorrow's gonna be a shit day, so. As the sun goes down, so must I. To be back up again long before it rises again. I really don't see a whole lot of sunlight. Well, My current well, hours during the winter months. Get that back. Right, I'm just going to... Technically owned by the board, long since abandoned. We reached HRS 1084, Captain. It's emitting a very weak docking signal. I almost mislabeled it as normal etheric static. Okay. We save, we done. Thanks for hanging out, folks. It's been a pleasure as always. Until the next time, I have been Pete, a.k.a. Crimson. Enjoy the rest of your day.